Hi, this is Dr. Ram from MedManus. This week's video is about thyroid histology and I'm going to give you some overview and then I'll go for this slide. So thyroid gland is situated immediately below the larynx and in front of trachea and the thyroid hormones increases the metabolic rate of a body. This is the important function of a thyroid hormones. What are all the hormones secreted by the gland? T3 and T4 is a major hormone that is secreted by the gland and also the calcitonin that plays an important role in calcium homeostasis. So this is the slide and the most distinguishing feature of a thyroid gland is the presence of the follicles. There are many follicles here and these thyroid follicles are lined by cuboidal epithelial cells that secretes T3 and T4 into the circulation. Note that this thyroid gland has a huge capacity for storing thyroid hormones inside the follicle which we call it as colloid. So the colloid is present inside the follicle. This colloid contains a very important glycoprotein which is called thyroglobulin. This thyroglobulin is secreted by the cuboidal epithelial cells. And this thyroglobulin is iodinated to form the thyroid hormones. So when this gland gets a stimulus, the thyroid hormones are cleaved off from thyroglobulin and released into the circulation. So colloid is nothing but iodinated thyroglobulin. And the final point about the parafollicular space. So the, this parafollicular region contains cells which is called C cells which secretes calcitonin that plays a very important role in calcium homeostasis. So what is the take home point? So the thyroid gland contains follicles. These follicles are lined by cuboidal epithelial cells and filled with colloid and the colloid is iodinated thyroglobulin. Note that thyroglobulin is nothing but a glycoprotein secreted by the cuboidal epithelial cells and the thyroglobulin contains the thyroid hormones. I hope you enjoyed this session. Thank you. See you with more interesting videos.